up and back. So let's play with now on part four. Victim's name is David Shannon, a Gotham Optics employee sent here to repair a faulty network tower. But what killed him? Scanning the DNA impact on the wall should provide an answer. Yeah, this is only in this game, by the way. Impact analysis indicates the victim was killed by some kind of explosion originating in that access panel. I should scan it for additional clues. You can't rewind like this in Arkham City or Arkham Asylum. Should have said it the other way around. It looks like the panel was rigged to detonate when swiped with a key card. Someone really didn't want this tower repaired. And it looks like that same someone left a set of fingerprints behind. Alfred, I'm uploading some prints for analysis. Let me know what comes back. Certainly, sir. Searching now. And here we are. They belong to one John F. Baker. He's a rather unremarkable criminal. Small jobs, mostly. And this... Mm, curious. What's curious? Mr. Baker's dead, sir. His body was recovered from the Diamond District just under an hour ago. Looks like someone's tying up loose ends. I can bypass the booby-trapped access panel with my cryptographic sequencer, but I'll need the encryption codes from the victim's access card. Reviewing the crime scene will show me where it is. I'm not going to get 100% on this because that took ages when I was doing it for myself. I was trying to load and save at the same time. Yeah, that's never going to work. Alfred, contact the GCPD. Let them know about the body. Send the data for my analysis too. Certainly, sir. Does this mean you found the source of the disturbance? I think so. Jezebel Plaza, right, okay, yeah, I could do that. I'm running out of time. I should head for Jezebel Plaza. I need any other guidance for special assignment. Stand by. I'm the man. 
man on the man on the man. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I'm the man, I'm the man, I'm the man. Yes, I am, yes, I am, yes, I am. Love that song. Yep, I'm just going to quickly do another part. Okay, bye.